The din of kitchen workers making food to help the homeless. No, this isn't a place for handouts. We're at Cafe 2, a high-end uptown restaurant with a program that trains the homeless for jobs in the food industry. I had a nice job, very stable. I never needed anybody before in my life. It was no problem. But once you lose one little thing, it's really easy to fall. At her lowest point, Ann Enlow became one of Chicago's 48,000 homeless. Then she started training that taught her how to prepare, cook, and serve food that people can dig into. It's a 90-day program. When you get finished, you have a sanitation license and job referral for the rest of your life. Margaret Haywood runs the program. She says teaching someone to cook is much more valuable than giving them a meal. People often have this perception that people who are homeless don't want to work or they're not trying to better themselves. When they come here, they can see people who really are working on their futures. People don't realize once you're coming from the bottom, it's extremely hard to get back up on your own. Enlo heard about the program through Sarah's Circle, a nearby nonprofit that helps homeless women. Here in Uptown, a lot of agencies will work together to help people improve their lives. This is pretty much the center of homelessness in the city. Uh, that's why there are a lot of resources. There's a lot of shelters and job training programs. Within a month, I, was, I had my own place again. So it's an incredible program. With the help of Cafe 2, Enlo's no longer scraping by. She's surviving and thriving. Cat Coo, Northwestern New Zealand.